Hello, this is Lego Guy 830 and this is an important update. I answer a lot of you guys' questions, so just watch the whole video so you don't answer questions I uh, you don't comment questions I already answered. Alright, so let's just get started with Lego. Uh so I'll start on the left and go to the right. Um, guys, I just have a American medic. He's not my design. He's just a normal medic. Yeah. Unpatch, a uh, patch medic uh, thing. Yeah. A medic patch on the helmet on the medic on the man patch. Then a little American flag. Um, this is my SWAT guy. Work in progress. He... Is pretty neat. Um, if you guys are wondering where I got that, I got it from this set right here, which I'll explain in a sec. Um, he's gonna be getting a black one, a uh, modern combat helmet, but for now he just has a dark tan. Uh, all my guys now, uh, they have sticky decals, so they look a lot better now, and they don't peel off. Like paper and glue stick ones. Then a lot of my Germans now have um, uh, these little patches on them. Uh, here's my Mon Warfare 2 guy. He is 90% done. Uh, he just needs better. He's going to get it. I'm going to give him a decal. Make him look cooler. Uh, brick arms, modern assault carbine or something. Which I think it looks awfully like a scar. So, and then it just has a micro uh, uh, night vision goggles. I don't say no. Why I say micro binoculars? But uh, they're just goggles glued with binoculars glued on them. Yeah, that's pretty much it for him. Still whip. Uh, then here's this guy. He's my German. Waifin SS camo guy. Submachine gunner, so he's pretty neat. Uh, mm, these are paper glue stick decals only because I made this guy actually like a couple months ago. So never actually showed you guys him. Uh, then he has this little decal right there, which I think it looks kind of like two lightning bolts. So, yeah, then this comes MP40, dark gray pants. Uh, here's a comparison to my other guy that looks similar. So, yeah. Um, then my favorite guy is this medic I made. He was pretty hard. But I basically, because this isn't one decal, I actually just took like a German decal right here, then a red cross decal here, then put these little arm uh, straps right there. Uh, that's just blank, and then I put these little pouches, and then put decals all over his helmet. So it was pretty hard. Uh, so, and then onto my Springfield. It's just a normal Springfield. It's my design. It's uh, actually a, a, a 50 caliber brick arms uh, scope on an M1 Grand. And then this little bolt is actually just an antenna piece. I cut the top off and just glued it on there. So that's it for guys. And then I'll just show you guys pretty quickly the little tank I bought. Uh, so yeah. This was only like five bucks. I bought it at Walgreens, which is a drugstore, if you don't know what that is. Uh, yeah, so it's super small. I wouldn't, I mean, it's only seven dollars, but it's made by Best Blocks or something like that. So, if you guys, I would only recommend it if you don't have the parts to make your own tank, because it's like pretty lame. Hey, but it was only five dollars, so yeah. Um, anyway, well, I'm going to be talking, uh, answering a lot of your questions, so here's just some guys to look at. Okay, 
So, a lot of you guys have been asking, when am I going to do the contest? Uh, my 300 subscriber contest? Well, I'm long past 300 subscribers, and I'm almost to 400, actually, now. <laughs> Alright, so that is no longer going to be a 300 subscriber contest, but it's still going to happen. I repeat, it is going to happen still. Um, the reason I just haven't done it is I've been very busy, and I just, I still need to get prizes, so it's going to happen sometime, sometime around after Christmas, because that's when I get all, that's when I get some money, so then I can have better prizes instead of just like a $2 prize, so it will happen sometime, sometime around Christmas. Um, some other questions I've been getting are, oh, I was blinking out, uh, oh, oh yeah, so a lot of you guys have been asking, like, kind of questions that I've already answered, so, like, a lot of you guys ask questions that I answer in a video, like, the same video, so, uh, just kind of like, I guess you could say, like, think before you comment, Watch the whole video before you comment something, because uh, it's getting kind of old and annoying. Um, so, my, uh, ah, my friend, he just made a new YouTube channel. He does snowboarding videos and stuff like that, so if you guys like snowboarding, you guys should check him out. I'll put a link somewhere. And then, one more person, if you guys could just check out, uh... His name is Fireflash101. He makes awesome stop motion videos. Uh, so, and he almost has 50 subscribers. So, if you guys could just check him out too, I'll put a link somewhere. And so, one more thing is I'm actually a YouTube partner now. So, if you guys don't know what that is, it means like I basically get ads on my YouTube videos and every time someone clicks on that ad I get like a nickel so if you guys could just like click some of those ads that would be helpful um and thanks you guys for subscribing I never actually thought I'd get to be a partner but so yeah thanks again um I'll I would never be a partner without the support of you guys so um yeah that's, I just have, very happy in my partners, oh, thanks, I've said that like five times now, but I'm just happy that I'm a partner, okay, so, um, I'm no longer accepting any f random friend invites, uh, so I actually have to, I'm actually checking your channel now, so if you ask me to be my friend, and you just have like no videos, I'm probably not gonna, um, accept your, um, friend invite, so, if you guys are wondering why some of you guys are getting rejected, that's why. Uh, I'm not doing sub for sub anymore, a lot of you guys should already know that. I never did, except for in the, when I just started. So, okay. Um, that's pretty much it, so... Uh, rate, comment, subscribe, and goodbye.